How's it going, all you guys and girls in the Illumination? Time to jump aboard the Loon Train. It's me, it's me, it's JJD, JJ Double J, the Illuminator here. Also known by almost countless other aliases and nicknames, but we won't get into that right now. I know it's pretty much a dead subject now, but it's just something I was thinking about today. Remember back, I think it was January of 2021, there was a group of people that were trying to sue Subway because they were saying that the tuna sandwich contained absolutely no tuna. Even though to this day, Subway claims that their tuna is 100% wild caught tuna and mayonnaise. That's how they make their tuna sandwich, according to Subway. But the backstory was that there was a growing suspicion that the tuna actually contained no tuna whatsoever. And it was just a whole bunch of other fish uh, just all mangled up and, and put in there. Um, kind of like there's a seafood salad where it's not crab, it's all other fish, but it tastes like crab, but it's a lot cheaper. So that being said, they tried to take it to court after sending the tuna from different subways to an independent lab. The lab says there's no tuna in it, but the case got thrown out of court. But the interesting thing is, the case might have gotten thrown out of court, but it never confirmed what Subway admits that they use tuna. So it wasn't like it got thrown out of court because Subway proved they use tuna. I guess it got thrown out of court because of being ridiculous or something to that effect. But it's got to make you wonder. It might be a dead subject, but it still raises the question, is it 100% tuna? Is it 50% tuna? Is it 20% tuna? Is there any tuna in it? Just because it tastes like tuna doesn't mean that it is. And that's the bottom line. Did Subway get away with a fast one? I really don't know. That's, that's for you to judge. My idea on the whole subject and my opinion on the whole subject is that without concrete proof, then there just is no way of knowing. And it makes me think that until I know for sure, I'm just going to assume that it's a little on the fishy side, and no pun intended. But what are your thoughts? Put your comments below. I'm off to the races. I love you all. Stay safe. Take care. This is The Illuminator, and I'll be back. Game over. You know, getting yourself into a belly full of trouble all the time doesn't make it any easier.